Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So if you're a music producer, you know that buying gear can get really freaking expensive, but you can actually save a lot of money if you buy used gear. And there are a lot of websites out there where you can really get the most bang for your buck. So if you wanna know which websites to go to to save money on used gear, keep watching. The first place is probably the most obvious, but that is Amazon but you don't wanna go straight to buying something completely like just brand spick and new. You wanna to go to the use section. There's actually a lot of sellers out there that are probably selling the product that you want. Maybe not completely new, but like new or even used, but still in very, very good condition. I bought the TC Helicon Voice Live Touch 2 used on Amazon. And honestly, I saved so much freaking money because of that. The next place where you're likely to find affordable prices on used gear is eBay. I feel like eBay isn't talked about enough nowadays. Basically with eBay, you can actually bid on an item and if you're the only bidder, then hey, you get the you get the thing. There's also just like a buy now option if you don't want to necessarily bid, if you just like want to buy it right now. They have options for that as well. Another place where you can find affordable gear is on sweetwater.com. So basically with sweetwater.com, it's similar in terms of like you can find some used gear on there, but you can also purchase um, any gear and like have like a payment plan on there as well. So if you want to pay like just like 20 bucks a month kind of thing, that's an option too. Sweetwater.com is definitely geared more towards musicians. So it's definitely a good place to check out. Another website that you want to check out is Reverb.com. So it's another website that's geared towards musicians and basically it's kind of similar. You can find used stuff, you can even sell your stuff in there as well. And it's just one of those things where you honestly just never know what kind of great deal you might find. Next place where you might want to find some used gear is Facebook Marketplace. Some of you guys might not know, but Facebook has its own marketplace system, kind of like Craigslist, but I actually kind of like it better. Basically, you input your location in there and it's going to show you a bunch of products that are being sold in your area. I really, really enjoy it because you can message people and everybody's always like looking on Facebook. So you get replies right away usually. So it's possible that if you find a piece of gear that you like, you can actually get it that same day. And last but not least, there is this app called Offer Up. It's kind of similar with Facebook Marketplace in the sense that you input your city and you can basically find all the gear or like all the stuff that's like being sold in your area. And just like with Facebook, if you find something you like, you can message the person and potentially get your gear that same day. I will say though, definitely be careful if you're using Facebook Marketplace or OfferUp and meeting people in person. Make sure that if you are buying gear from someone in person, you have a way to kind of test out the gear and also just make sure that you meet up in a public area just for safety reasons. I forgot to mention one more thing. Also, you guys don't neglect the used section of your local music shop. I found this used and actually that acoustic guitar. I got um, the demo version, which saved hundred bucks on basically both of this stuff. So all together, that's $200 that I saved just by buying used gear. So if you guys are balling on a budget like me, now you know the places to go to where you can get used gear for an affordable price. That's about it for this video, you guys. I hope it was helpful. If it was, please give the video a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, definitely do so. I make a lot of music production related videos, tutorials, walkthroughs, and basically anything that I learn music production wise, I kind of just pass it on to you guys. Alrighty, thanks for watching, you guys. I'll see you on the next one.